Hey guys, this is just a quick video to show you how to use uh, regions to create a chunk anchor, uh, primarily for uh, use in nuclear power plants. They keep generating power when you're not around. This is going to require you to use the console. Uh, there's two commands or three commands you're going to need. Uh, the first thing you have to do is define a region that uh, has or that contains the chunks that all the components of your power system are in. So that includes the uh, redstone switches you use to turn it on, the uh, storage units you're using, and the reactor itself. So to find a region, you need a tool called a wand. So that's just uh, two slashes and one. And that'll give you what looks like a wooden pickaxe. Or, uh, or sorry, a wooden axe. That's uh, the world edit tool for selecting a region. So to select a region, you're basically selecting the two opposing corners of a cube. So for me, for uh, my power plant, uh, my control system is here. So first I'm gonna select uh, the first corner of the uh, cowboy that that's gonna go in. Uh, next I'm gonna go where my reactors themselves are. So my reactor's here. Whoops. I saw that should have been the second position, so I gotta go back and select the first one again. So there we go, so now we have a box selected that contains the chunks of uh, our control system and our reactor. And my storage units are close enough that uh, we'll be able to store stuff in there without having to expand it to where they are. Okay, right, so the next thing you do is the command you want is CL, for chunk loader, add, and then a name for your region. Uh, this is my power plant, so I'm just going to call it my power. And there we go, keeping three chunks loaded in the region my power. So that'll prevent these chunks from unloading. Uh, so if we look at our remaining time right now, it's at 131.19. We'll kick the reactor on, and that'll start counting down. And see over here, our storage pool is going up. So then let's uh, just go somewhere else. That's quite a few chunks away. So I'm just go back to my home place, and that's at 131.05. Let's go back here. And this place is a long way away, so it's definitely uh, under normal circumstances would the power plant. Just around here for a little bit. All right, so we're gonna go back to our power plant. There, and uh, that's counted down a bit, and our storage pool's gone up. So the reactor kept running while we were uh, away. It didn't unload the chunks, which is great. So before you uh, leave, or before you destroy the uh, chunk anchor, uh, you might want to shut your reactor off, though not necessary. And to remove the chunk anchor, it's the same thing, it's CL, remove, and then the name of your chunk anchor, and it says region my power is removed. So those chunks will now unload. If you have any questions, let me know.